Hello, um, yeah, I'm going to show you today how to add um, social media buttons onto your website. Um, this is for Zencart version 1.5 and I'm using the template, um, what's it called? Basque Black, yeah that's the one. Right, as you can see if you scroll down my page you cannot see any social media buttons at all. But then what happens if you click on a product? And as you can see, the product is going to open up into its own product page, which we're all pretty familiar with. Now, if you scroll down, you see there it is, my social media button. So you've got Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Plus, plus you've got the share button, which is a real good feature of doing it this way. And just hover above it, you see you've got other options um, for other blogging sites and other internet sites, there's loads of sites in there, Bebo, um, the lots, 321 other sites in there as well, that are all blogging and, um, blogging and uh, other social media sites. So this is a real good way of doing it because you don't just get Facebook, Twitter and Google Plus like with a lot of other methods, you get a whole lot more. Right, the first thing I've done to find out how to do this installation was I went to a website called navspan.com um, at the moment, they've only got two articles on there on Zencart, and this is where I found out how to do it in this particular way. Um, find the part where it's got, um, I think I put in the title, Social Media Optimization Web Design Zencart, and it'll bring you to this page here. Um, read along the article, it's got steps on it going one to six showing you how to do the install but I'll talk you through it as well now the first thing you want to do is go to this website called add this and there's a link there on the page as well go to that site um, sign up and um, I logged in with my Facebook account personally and you get to a page that looks like this and all you do simply is you choose what sort of buttons you want whether you want small ones, big ones, or you want the little ones with the counter beside it. And then just click this, grab it, and it brings up the code like that, which I've highlighted already. Then you just want to copy and paste that into your Zencart file. Now the file that you need to do this is on the um, Navspan webpage. And if you scroll... to step number five, that's it. This bit here is highlighted, includes templates, template default template, and you want the uh, TPL product info display PHP file. That is the file you need to edit in order to install this. Now, all you do is once you've actually got to that file, you want to scroll, puts me halfway down, as you can see, and you get to this line of code here. It says um, BR class clear both. And what you want to do is, I'll go back to how this was before. Right now, on this line here, as you can see, where it's got product details list and you've got the clear booth above it, where it's got the question mark and the forward tag. Put your cursor there and press enter. Then you just paste in the code that you got from um, uh, from add this. So you just right click, paste, then save it to your um, server. Quite simple. So just click save. shut it down and then when you go to your website you should have your social media buttons um, thanks for listening I hope this helps um, goodbye